in sweep, I reckon outside hand, if you could all get a box of nails on the way home, um, drive it through that centre knuckle in all your athletes outside hand when they've when they got the handle. Um, and, and the handle, I didn't mean that, um, the handle will rotate around that inside knuckle. So coming forward, knuckles stay at right angle to the boat all the time. If we go around like that, you've seen that one? Yeah, elbow around like that. And the inside arm's gonna be like that too. Um, knuckles stay square to the boat at the catch. You could have the handle, that's an extreme length, but the handle would be more like that, okay? At the finish, you'd want your elbow to come through. As soon as the elbow stops, well, so does the pressure. And so to have that continuous movement around the back, I think that little knuckle there would be more in contact with the handle right at the back than anywhere else. That one, you get that from the front, that's gonna be shouldery. Seen that one from the front? That's pressure on the inside knuckle. If you keep that handle rotating around the inside, that uh, middle knuckle, and being connected to little finger at the end, fantastic. And that is where the obvious lever is, isn't it? On the end of the handle. Inside hand needs to be able to roll the blade square and feathered without, um, without losing connection right there, right through to the release. Um, you start doing this one, pushing the handle away before we finish pulling with the outside hand, we've got a problem.